Hello everyone and welcome to four brush hacks I use in every painting, more or less brush techniques. And this first one has to do with using thick paint. And one of the key points is to push your brush through the paint so you get this nice bead of paint on the end of it. I feel this is essential for painting thick on thick. Look how easily that paint just comes right off. Here you see me putting even thicker paint on top of the initial thick paint. The other key point is to keep the angle between the brush and the canvas as small as possible. The flatter the brush is to the canvas, the easier the paint comes off. Especially if you're painting thick on thick. Make sure you have a nice bead of paint on your brush first though. Hack number two, adding texture. Here I've used the back of the brush to add grasses, sticks, and gnarly bark, but other uses could be for fences, wires, and fur, hair, etc. It's as simple as dragging the back of the brush through wet paint. It creates an effect that can never be achieved with a brush alone. It also works great for creating the illusion of fur. Hack number three, reducing the value of what's been painted. Working on a white canvas, and you have an area that you want to reduce the value a little bit with, but don't want to do a new mixture, simply just scratch that area out, and it reduces the value. It's a slight difference, but that's the nuance I was wanting. Hack number four, sunning your painting. We all really need to sun our painting. I just prefer to scratch it in with the back of my brush. I find it easier than using the smaller brushes. And if you want a little more detail, just sharpen the tip of your paintbrush. As you see, it creates a much finer point, and thus a much more defined signature. Right now, I think I have more sharpened paintbrushes than I do pencils. If this video is helpful for you, please hit that like button and don't forget to share it with your friends. Cheers!